Hello, my friends. This is Carlos. And with all these new AI opportunities, one of the questions is how can I really be more effective? How can I create more content? And one of the ways is that you can probably clone your voice and you probably have heard, but also seen some that are a little bit robotic and a little bit weird. This is me really, you can see me moving, but what I'm looking for is how can I clone my voice so then I can actually create content faster or it could be training or it could be social media posts or anything like that. So I'm going to share one of the websites that I love that I have found that it's awesome to be able to clone your voice effectively. So here I go. So we are here in 11 labs and you can register. There's a link under this video that you can uh, register with and I have different options so I can create an instant clone and there is a professional clone. So I'm going to go here into voices and create and you depend on the, pro, uh, the level that you acquire, you can have different amount of clones you can get. But one of the things is that you want the professional clone. And the difference, what I found is that the instant clone will sound like you, but doesn't have all the inflection. Or let's say in my case, my accent, even though I have been speaking English, Spanish and Portuguese for a long time, sometimes it doesn't catch it that well. But when I do the professional cloning, it actually does. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click here and I'm going to tell you that you should be in a room that is free of noises, that there should not be no music or anything like that. But if you record your voice without nothing else, then you can upload your voice and it should be between half hour and two hours. So what I'm going to do is that I finished recording a course that I'm launching and I took all the audio from that and I'm going to input it so I can use it as the voice. And then you click the I confirm you start. And what I'm going to ask you is that you want to upload. So I'm going to put here Carlos professional voice. And one of the things that he asks you is to detect in what language you recorded the voice, not the one that you want to use it, because this is one of the great things that 11 labs allow you to do. You can record your voice in one language and actually translate it automatically to another language. But in here, because we're training the model is actually asking for the language that you recorded the voice. So what I'm going to do in here, give me a sec. I'm going to be bringing a couple of files. So you see uploaded three of them. Let me try to bring a couple more. Okay. And the benefit is that if you give the training model more information, it actually will create a great profile for your voice. So after I have everything, um, this is my voice in the studio with prof. And again, this is your description for you and create professional voice. So what's going to happen now is that this is, uh, this will actually start creating your voice profile and it will send you a notification when it's ready. You cannot use this right now. I, I want to repeat, you will not be able to use it right away. You have to wait because it's creating a profile. The instant clone, on the other hand, you can use it right away. So what I'm going to do is that I'm going to stop this video right now. And when I come back, then I'm going to show you the finished product of the voice and how we can generate the voice. Okay, my friends. So after all the processing, I'm back into my 11 lab account. So it took probably a couple of hours. I left it working, did some other stuff, came back. And I come back into voices, create, 
and in here you're gonna see my professional clone and it says click to verify so this will take me through the verify process so i'm gonna start verification it's gonna tell me if this is it and it will add some text it's gonna ask me to allow it never mistake motion for action okay so now you verify my account so what it did is that you actually check what i was saying with what you already got in the model and now this is going through the final step this is the most important so the fine tuning is when you're gonna take your voice and really give it that real voice like so you don't sound metallic or something like that so now you have to be paying attention to your email because you're gonna get a validation email when your voice is ready okay my friends now we're back and the voice has finished the cloning process so you're gonna see hey your voice is ready so let's try this so now when i go i have then the different versions of the voices and i have then uh here says cv english instant clone spanish voice so if you want to know which one specifically just go back to your voices when you click create you're gonna see your voices so here you have the professional one then you have my spanish clone and english so right here i want to try this one so let's click use and you see right here it says carlos professional voice the one that we gave them. and you're gonna see that there's different options in how to configure your voice so the voice settings is gonna give you the option that you can switch a little bit between the tone of the voice the clarity how to see it so at the beginning when you're working through your voice and you're setting everything you're going to have to play a little bit to see how it sounds then you have the modes let me go back so you can see it here when you say 11 turbo when you click on it you have different modes you have multilingual so that means that your voice even though you did not speak that language when you record the voice you can type the text and it will translate it to that you can have a multilingual one english and turbo two that depend on how your voice sound, it will tell you this one is a better option. So in this case, we're gonna go with Turbo 2. And then I have some text in here. And this is one of the intros for one of our tech podcasts. So I'm going to generate and I type the intro. So I'm gonna click generate. Welcome to the sweet spot, the ultimate podcast for technology leaders and innovators. Join your hosts, Paul Lewis, Howard Holton, and Carlos Vargas, as they bring over 75 years of combined expertise directly to you. Navigate the ever-evolving tech landscape, tackle leadership challenges, and excel in your tech career. Whether you're an executive, director, or tech professional, The Sweet Spot is your guide to leading and succeeding in the technology world. Get ready to take your leadership to the next level. Welcome to the sweet spot. So there you have it. That's a first pass at your voice. So now what you can do again, it's perfect. It's my pitch is everything. So now you can play with when you put stop. So a space is a stop. If you put quotations, you're going to read that. And after that, you're going to stop. So now you can play with your voice and after you have it ready, you can just hit the download button right here, or you can share it. And there you have automatically clone your voice. And now you can use it for social media. Let's say that you're doing a training. You can write your whole training in spots of no longer than 5,000 words in this mode. And you can then go through it and just put the slides. But there's another mode that you can actually create a project. And that takes a little bit more time, but you can then convert let's say a whole book and then you can clone your voice and do your own other book. So my friends, this all for now. So you can clone your own voice. There's a link below so you can get started 
with 11 laps. You can go to carlosvargas.com forward slash 11 laps where you can get a trial and start using your air voice. My friends, we'll see you in my next video.